the idea and the hope is that the um, environmental impact assessment provisions will get to these new technologies before they're actually implemented and require a showing of potential range of impacts and um, in the strongest version, actually making sure that there's sufficient information to make this informed decision that you're not going to be causing significant adverse impacts. Um, environmental impact assessments are commonly used for site-specific assessments of the potential impacts and alternatives. What the treaty also has potential to um, create are platforms for strategic environmental assessments, which would actually um, encourage, uh, I won't say force, um, coordinated research and understanding of a particular technology or a new activity. And this is where I really see as the important uh, role of the new treaty combined with the UN Decade of Ocean Science. So the environmental impact assessments need to look at proposed activities for their impacts on the ocean climate um, system, and then also to make sure that these new technologies that are being proposed are fully um, studied, understood, and that the public is fully transparently and inclusively consulted. So those are really the, the three key points of uh, precaution, humility, and uh, research to make sure that we have enough knowledge to make informed decisions.